Welcome back to Lance Weekly. I'm here with head coach Terry Donovan. Last week we played Cannon Falls at Cannon Falls and we lost 46 to 6. How will you help strengthen your team after the last couple of losses? Well, a couple of things that we did is we switched some guys around in some positions that we think will help bolster it. Yesterday I thought we had our best practice of the year. Um, guys came with a ton of energy and some newfound hope on what their week looks like. Yeah. And then how does it feel to coach? not coach your son this year. <laughs> it's, I've got to coach three of them, so it's been, it was really a, a special time for me to be able to stand shoulder to shoulder to them as they became men. Uh, it, 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 it's a, it is a little different, but again, there was a lot, there was a time between Riley and Matt that I didn't have any sons on the team either. Uh, we are getting to go watch AJ play on Sunday though, so that's cool. Nice. And then after coaching the senior class for three years now, what is your favorite thing about coaching them? Oh, I think just the togetherness that they have. They're a really loose group. They like to have fun, um, and and they're just their energy is 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 uh, contagious. Yeah, thank you. Yep, I'm here with Roger Gull. He's the linebacker and JV defensive coach. How long have you been coaching, Roger? Uh, my thirty third year. Yeah. Okay. And where have you been coaching? I started out in my hometown of Algoma, Wisconsin. I went down to Burlington, Wisconsin from 2001 to 2010. I can't take any credit on Tony Romo. He was in college already when I started coaching there. Then I was at Luxembourg Casco for 10 years, Southern Door for one, back to Luxembourg Casco for one, and up in Ashland for one. Nice. And then what encouraged you to come to La Crescent to I, coach? I went to college years ago in La Crosse. I enjoyed the area. I wanted to move back. Uh, things didn't work out up in Ashland, either teaching-wise or coaching-wise. So I decided to move back to La Crosse, and I sent a letter out to all the coaches in the area, and Coach Donahue answered it. Or Do Donovan, excuse me. Coach Donovan answered it, and uh, it's been terrific. I really enjoy working with him and the rest of the staff. Yes, thank you. I'm here with Mason Gates. He's a defensive lineman and a junior. How did it feel getting to start in your first varsity game last Friday? Well, it was pretty nerve-wracking, but I think I did pretty fine for what was considered. Yeah. thought it was okay. And then who has been your biggest motivation? Well, um, like you say, Coach Terry Donovan, Coach Brendan LaRue, uh, my mom, my dad, my grandma. I love them all very dearly. and I'd like to thank them for being motivation when times get tough. And I just really appreciate having them in my life. Thank you. No problem. Yeah. I'm here with Maddox. He's a safety and a junior. Why did you decide to join football this year? Uh, I joined because uh, I just wanted to be part of you know the football community. Mm -hmm. Gotten uh, like recruited by Terry. Yeah. So, yeah. And then this being your first year playing football, who's helped you kind of prepare for the big stage of football? Uh, probably Cadillac and uh, Jerry Marks. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks. I'm here with Alex Von Arks. He's a running back, wide receiver, and a senior. How did it feel to score the only points last week? Um, you know, it felt pretty good, but at the same time, it was like kind of whatever. But yeah. And then, how do you keep your teammates motivated through these losses? Uh, I just uh, tell them to keep working hard and motivate them as much as I can. Yeah, thank you.